Okay. Good morning and good afternoon. This is Dina Moskowitz, CEO of SASMAX, and I'm here with Cassandra Anderson, Crescendo VP of Channel Sales for Crescendo. And I'm very excited to bring her on. Crescendo has been a great uh, partner to SASMAX over the last few years, and we've seen so many excellent opportunities come from it for our reseller partners, and I look forward to having her uh, reintroduce herself to uh, our newer SAS resellers and, and hopefully create new opportunities for you. So to get started, let me just give you an overview for those of you who are new to SASMAX. Our goal at SASMAX is that we connect really good B2B cloud software companies who have been vetted and are trusted and established uh, or innovative and new but still uh, established and stable with IT companies and, and solution providers like you. And the goal is to give you both new and recurring revenue opportunities that, uh, that are accelerated. Uh, we're much like Unmatch.com but for SaaS and with a, a much higher personal touch because uh, not all uh, solution providers are online all day long and so we have more personal relationships and more outreach. We help both sides to collaborate and grow and succeed. And so, for example, we have new SaaS companies joining SASMAX all the time, and they're looking to identify great quality established resellers who are selling to the right sets of clients. And similarly, our solution providers who join SASMAX typically work with us and communicate with us about the types of clients they have and the types of solutions they're looking for, including the types of bundles, whether it's horizontal or vertical. And we work with them to establish the right uh, introductions and meet the right partners so that you can uh, accelerate those decisions and bring the best value to your clients. We have thousands of IT companies that already participate, um, mostly throughout North America, although we do have uh, extended into Europe and some into Australia and New Zealand, and it's just growing on a daily basis. And our goal specifically for resellers is helping you find the right SaaS applications and earn more revenue. Um, so when when vendors join SASMAX, we make sure that they're offering special incentives and offers for you and bounties and that they have reseller programs and that we vet those. And for those who may be new to the channel, we actually help them to design and develop and launch reseller programs based upon best practices so that you know that they are comfortable in how to work with you. We facilitate personalized introductions to the right executives for each uh, each channel, uh, each SaaS that you want to work with. And uh, basically our goal is to save you time and be sort of a, an all stuff, no fluff type of partner to you, a personal concierge. Um, and providing you education like today with the snapshot webinars, we also do partner perspective webinars where we bring on peers who are already selling cloud services. And we, we try to create that forum and environment and community so that you are learning that you're not alone as you adopt new SaaS solutions into your uh, into your line cards. We also offer and are, have been rolling out a new affiliate network so that many of the SaaS applications that are in SaaS Max are also then offering um, online digital tracking types of campaigns so that you can grab online content and online codes and be able to use that in your in your digital marketing tools. We can explain that offline if you have any interest. And so I'd be happy now to present Cassandra Anderson, who is a very well established and experienced channel sales executive who has brought together a really strong uh, channel team. I think you're primarily uh, go to market through the channel, right? And um, correct, exactly. And uh, we know that a lot of our reseller partners are very happy with uh, the way that you engage and work with your partners. So, Cassandra, uh, go for it. Welcome. Well, thank you so much, Dina. I appreciate the opportunity to present to your reseller channel today. Primarily because we've just been so engaged with SASMAX and find so much value working with your organization and we feel that SASMAX resellers have that same advantage. So one of the things that I did here on this slide instead of talking about myself is really talk about the SASMAX special offers. And um, it's I figured let's start with what's in it for the SASMAX reseller. And uh, one of the things that we're doing is we're offering an additional commission incentive for specifically for SASMAX partners of an extra 
uh, one month MRC on top of the already 25% evergreen that we pay our program, partner programs. And we have additional partner programs outside of a reseller partner. And so if someone wants to dip their toe into the unified communications world, they're not sure VoIP is a good fit for them, we have affiliate and referral programs as well. Um, and so we really want to take good care of our partners. And we designed the program with that in mind. So some of the things that we did was just build in a very high evergreen commission, but also an upfront uh, commission, same 25% same or even higher. And then we wanted to, everybody needs phones, including reseller partners. So as a special offer to staff max resellers, we did a 40% off of telephone service for your partners. And the reason we did that is you sell what you use and what you know. Um, you couldn't probably sell Microsoft Exchange or Office 365 or Intuit or Clio, which are all good partners with SaaSmax as well, if you didn't know how to use it. So we find that that is a good tool. And then we didn't build in a quota because especially for SaaS app partners as well as reseller resellers that focus primarily on data products, they're not necessarily comfortable in the voice space at first. And so we didn't want to burden them with a the quota. I started in the partner channel. I've been here for about 20 years and I started at a partner. And, and so I come for, to this role with the, that in mind. What did I think as a partner? How was I growing my business? And what we're seeing is partners achieve 100% plus growth in their businesses year over year without necessarily expanding their existing customer base, which is always a good thing if you can sell more to an existing customer instead of necessarily needing to find a new customer. And so the next slide talks about really the highlights of what's in it for you. So uh, the course, the SASMAX special offers for you for SASMAX resellers, but the 25% that we pay commissions, that's a kind of across the board and the no quota. We also don't have any minimum users. So traditionally in this telecom space, people are like, hey, this is a lot of work to set up a phone system. We don't want to do that for one user. And we're willing to do that. And a lot of SAS partners, especially selling like a, an act or a CRM of some sort that's a SaaS app might have just that one accountant and they need phones too. So <laughs> there's, there's no minimum users. And then we pay this on an evergreen basis, meaning that just as long as they're our customer, they're your customer, you're receiving commissions for that sale. And what's interesting and what I found with partners and how we've helped them grow their business over 100% isn't just in our service. It's that they have a high service attach rate. So we know how to talk to customers about, I know you don't have a budget for the copy machine that you really want, but you know that's who's, who's brought us to the table. And, and so let us save you money on your telecom expenses every month so that you can afford these other tools that this partner brings to the table. And we've found that that's been a really great way to encourage customers to spend more with our partners and really still save money long term. Because it's not just about us and our resellers, it's also about the customer. And if we don't carry this uh, love and care for each piece, then, then we wouldn't be as successful as we are. And I think one of the big concerns that resellers have initially is, hey, can I add this to my portfolio? Is it easy to do? Uh, what kind of inventory do I have to buy? And we've made that very simple. So there's no technical certification. We have live and ongoing and online sales training. We assign a dedicated channel manager to every single partner so that they have a go-to. And then we have a team sales approach so that even if their channel manager is on the road, they still have somebody to go to. And there's just no inventory to stock. You don't have to worry about new parts. It's really a sales relationship that helps you grow your, the, your core business. So that's, uh, and for the customer perspective, they have a dedicated assigned project manager for their own implementations. You don't have to become a phone guy or gal to, to add this to your portfolio. And I think that's one of the most important things. And of course, I would be remiss not to talk about Crescendo and our data center and who we are as a company, but I don't want to bore you with that. 
because this is a very crowded space and so there's a lot of companies here and how do you filter through all the noise of which partner should I pick for voice because um, there's so many and I think one of the things that we bring to the table is just a very rich history of voice. We've been doing this since 1969 when our CEO, Steve Mihalo, founded Intertel. And our company has been around since 1995. And we had a data center for hosting websites long before we started building, building a telecom product. And so we're very secure because we've been handling e-commerce or what's called PCI compliant data for a really long time. We are publicly traded with no debt, so you know we're going to be here. And if you paid any attention to this market, so-and-so is being acquired by so-and-so every single day, whether it's Polycom, the bigger fish being kind of gobbled up by the new competitor in the space there, or you know, uh, Vonage buying up all the little VoIP resellers. And then their channel program changes, and you're kind of stuck holding the bag going, okay, what now? So we really are in a good place to keep you sheltered from that. And while this is our data center headquartered in Tempe, Arizona, I like to joke that the only weather we get here is heat. We have um, redundancy built into our redundancy on air conditioning. <laughs> but if there was some kind of catastrophic failure, because let's face it, it's technology, our data center is redundant to Amazon at uh, AWS. So, uh, and, and we play in a lot of verticals for you. And the reason I wanted to bring this up is because a lot of SaaS partners are vertical focused. So you might be providing legal software and you've partnered with SaaS Max vendor Clio who offers a cloud-based legal time management software. And that's your specialty and you're amazing there. That's okay. Not only do we have a very strong presence in the legal space, we also integrate with Clio. So these are things that when you are a SaaS Max reseller, you have the benefit of this vendor relationship. Dina and her team are incredible in the synergy among us uh, vendors. And, and so we've worked together to make sure that it's right for you. So some things to think about, though. Uh, medical and dental, we're HIPAA compliant. We have one of the largest construction firms, real estate. Anytime you have a multi-location company, they're really excited about the cloud. And I, I know the cloud, sort of this concept that I like to say nebulous uh, for fun, but, but they don't understand it, you do, that's why you're a SaaS reseller, and so you bring a lot of value to them. But they are excited about it because they've heard the hype that, hey, I can save money and all my locations can work together as one, and that's really true. And sort of the one specialty here that most SaaS products in the communication space or CAS products, communication as a service don't offer is high density analog. So what is that for you non-telecom guys and gals? What that means is that we can do a lot of analog phones or devices on our service. And that's very unusual uh, in the hosted space especially. So an example of that is assisted living. So many of us have aging parents and, and they're, they still want to be independent. They live in assisted living communities. And when they move into the assisted living communities, they have to call you know, CenturyLink or whoever the provider is and see if their number can go with them because they've had their number for 35, 40 years and they want to keep it. Everybody knows it. And then they have to pay that, a fee for that and they have to pay a fee to have the line installed in the building and all of these, like this chaos just to have a phone number. So we have taken that piece and made it so simple for assisted living facilities to provide that for the new residents and it's just transparent. The resident signs a paper saying I want to keep my number and we're able to port that number in and make it seamless for them. It's much faster. There's no install tech that has to come out and it's just a win-win for everyone, the customer, the resident, and our partners. And so our largest account is actually a multi-site assisted living facility that's working on now about 3,500 phones. So we're not isolated to that one five, ten phone account, we can grow into the thousands and that's no problem. So speaking of, you know, vertical markets, some logos here to show you some, some hot accounts that we have and kind of get your mind wrapped around about, oh, I have an American family insurance office, that would be great. Or, yeah, I have First American down the street and they have 50 phones. So these are logos that we've been very successful in. 
of course, the education space, the real estate space is just really um, blowing up right now. And um, they are trying to get rid of their old legacy phones. They're trying to save money. They're trying to address, and especially in the real estate space, high use technology that's very simple because realtors know real estate very well but, and they want to use the technology, but they don't want to learn the technology. So any of you focused in the real estate market know that's true and you're probably laughing to yourself right now, but we offer that to realtors, that find me, follow me feature where their office number and their cell number kind of work together as one service. And it's been, it's been very popular in that space. We have hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands of extensions in the real estate space just for realty executives and then additionally exit and, and more. So why do they love Crescendo? So those verticals are popular, but why Crescendo? And one of the reasons is because we manufacture the solution from the ground up. It's our software, it's our data center, it's our hardware, it's our applications, whether that's a mobile app for real estate or service tech writing tickets out there that needs to call the customer before he arrives or something to that effect. We manufacture all of this. And so it works very seamlessly and simply for the customer. So in a common scenario that's not crescendo, they buy their phones and the phones arrive, and then they have to go do some magic and know what an IP address is and program that into the phone. And it's very complicated for them, even though it would be simple to you and I because we've been doing this for years. We understand an IP address. We know what a MAC address is. But customers don't, and they don't want to have to do that. So in the Crescendo world, because we make the equipment, the physical equipment, we make the firmware and software that the equipment talks to, it's all very transparent and becomes this plug and play capability. And so we released a new line of phones as well. They're, they're beautiful phones and they cost far less than the competitive phones in the traditional telecom world. So if you were getting a premise-based quote, our phones are gigabit ethernet, and you'll see the, the picture of them on the next slide. They're, they're desi list, meaning they don't need paper labels, and they're, they're flexible, they're stocky, they're high definition, and they are uh, beautifully designed. So they're just sleek and bright and fun, and customers really like them. And they start as low as 159 for the 350 there, but still color display and gigabit ethernet and all of that. Additionally, they come with a lifetime warranty because we manufacture them. We know how that we can provide that. So with customers, they have something more with you than they have with others. And then the opportunity for our SaaS resellers to add dollars to that phone so that they can physically install it for the customer is there. So we allow you to pass through installation labor or just an additional markup to earn more than 25%. And so many of our MSP, which is managed service provider partners, are so used to getting, you know, five points and 10 points. So they're just excited about 25 points. Um, the, the thought of 40 points to like be there for their customers kind of is mind blowing for them. And we're glad to provide that experience. So the tool, because we build it, we, de we design it around a customer request. So what you see in the display here are two such examples of customer requests. So everybody wants some version of unified communication, but we had a customer say, look, we don't want to install anything. We don't want our IT provider to have to, to, to babysit this. We just want a cloud-based communicator. So we built this web-based communicator that allows you to drag and drop calls, see your teammates, see us when they're on the phone, uh, screen pop SaaS applications like Clio and others, uh, LinkedIn, the salesforce.com, NetSuite, that kind of thing. And it's just a really easy to implement. So there's not any software or complicated integration. It's just simple click to screen pop. And then the other is the dashboard. So we include call center at no additional charge as well. We provide this real-time dashboard. So what's happening with my agents, my calls, how many calls, how many have been received versus answered versus abandoned, that kind of thing. And in this telecom market, that's often $50 up to $200 per seat. And we're just including that at our standard per seat fee. And there's a slide that gives that as an example. Um, and so you'll see that. 
So these are just two examples of tools for customers, but we know we need tools for partners as well. So we created a, a browser-based or web-based portal that's also available on your mobile app. We allow you to do deal registration and kind of protect your account. Uh, you have a dedicated team of people working with you. There's a, a demo kit with live service so that you can get a feel for it, use it as a crash kit. So I have one partner, he's just a one-man show in Colorado, and he was able to turn his business around. So from nearly extinction, right, because he was just one guy, how much could one guy do, to uh, just an incredible business now with the cloud and how he was able to do that in northern Colorado and southern Wyoming is as these customers experienced failure, he would bring his demo kit out on site with live service and plug a couple of key phones in, forward their main number over to the demo kit so that they were back up and working, which gave him an opportunity to troubleshoot why their old phone system wasn't working as well as the customer saw, wow, this really is reliable because even though my system has failed, I, Crescendo's online. And, and so that's been a really good tool for him, and he's just grown his business tenfold in the last two years. So these are all tools that we make available for you. And the demo kit is really a choice of a one phone, a two phone, a three phone kit, kind of depending on what works for you. And on the next slide, you'll see a picture of that, as well as we want this to be free for you. Right? So there, we're giving away the monthly service, so there's a live service, there's live phone numbers, and is no cost to you, and there's a purchase of the equipment, but then within the first 120 days, we have a fast start bonus so that we can pay you back for the demo kicks. We don't want it to cost you anything, but we want to partner with you so that you have the tools that you need. And then you know, you'll, you'll find your first opportunity and we'll walk the customer through the process, we'll walk you through the process. And so let's say you, you're dipping your toe in and you have a five phone account. So on the next slide, you'll see an example of what that looks like. So customers can go anywhere from month to month all the way up to 60 months. Phone systems historically have been sold at 60 months. And so we have more than 50% of our customers signing 60 months agreement. Now think about from the perspective of your expected long-term revenue and what that does for your business valuation. So maybe you're at the last 10 years of your business and you want to retire and have a vacation home in Costa Rica or wherever that might be. Uh, that sounds fun to me. Let's go to Belize, right? But you need to build value in your business because your customer base is only worth very much less than you think unless there's a residual recurring revenue that can go along with it because they're your customers by goodwill they love you and because you're awesome but if you retire where does that go so that's I think a lot of partners are surprised when they when it comes time to sell their business and they go well like no it's worth this much this is what I'm doing every year in, in new business and they're like but that's you doing that you're you're selling that so we try to help customers and partners rather create this residual value in their business. And so a five phone customer, tiny little dip your toe in the water, if they sign a 60 month agreement or a 36 month agreement, you can see that their bill is very low. So that you'll probably be saving them 30% over what they pay right now, even more on the 60 month term. And if they're comparing it to a new solution from someone else, now you're looking at it probably closer to a 60% savings. So in this example, I chose a couple of the higher end phones and a couple of the standard phones. And so from an upfront revenue or an upfront cost, there's $1,100. Now that could be leased, doesn't have to be paid upfront, but what happens to you, for you, so that's very affordable for the customer and they usually get excited about that. But on the next slide, you'll see what does that look like long-term for you? So even just five phones, you have an upfront uh, dollars coming to you. So the customer phone costs were $995. If you didn't, or $999, if you didn't upgrade that at all, you didn't build anything into that, your payout is 25%. And so you get $249 right up front. And then in this example with $99.75, for SAS Max resellers, you would get an additional $99.75. I should have built that in here and I didn't because we have that promotion for you. And then monthly ongoing mailbox money, 25 bucks. 
Now, 25 bucks doesn't seem like a lot, but over time, if you continue to do that, you'll see how large it can grow. So let's take a look at the next slide, and we'll see if you just add one customer a month at $250 a month revenue to you, um, that ends up being just $3,000 a month in only 12 months, and that's just one new customer, or $15,000 a month in 60 months. So we, we talked about your 10-year time frame. Now we could probably reduce that to a five-year time frame. So we'll be in Belize in five years together. And then over that same 60 months, even starting at just $3,000 a month in the first 12, you're already up to $648,000 in just five years. So if, you, if you're if you looking for an exit strategy to your business, you know, Crescendo could be that exit strategy. Uh, uh, but if you're looking to grow your business, certainly you can find more than one new customer a month, and this could be just huge for you. And the reason we designed it this way is because we want to have a pure channel approach and we want to share in the, um, the benefit of this business. So we've definitely designed the program around that. So with that, I talked fast because I wanted to be really cognizant of your time and try and finish up fast. Uh, visit us at crescendo.com. If you go to crescendo.com slash crescendo slash partner, you'll get right to the three partner programs. They'll be described and you can sign up there. You can email us at channelpartners at crescendo.com or me personally at canderson at crescendo.com. And that's my number there listed below my name. And then the team number listed there. And just remember when you call in, uh, these some of the promotions are specifically for SAS Max resellers only. So be sure to mention SAS Max. Any questions? Excellent. Cassandra, that was really great, and thank you for keeping it uh, within the time frame. And uh, for those of you, thank you all for staying on. It looks like everyone pretty much stayed through the end, and so hopefully and, and expectedly there should be some good interest here. Uh, but Cassandra, I think um, one of the things I'd ask, I'd ask you, you mentioned it was a very crowded sector, right, of course, and so many times resellers are hearing from many different vendors. If there were two or three things that really stand out uh, as far as why your partners are so successful with you, what, what would you say those are? Well, really three things. So we offer one of the more lucrative programs, if not the most lucrative program in the space, um, specifically because we have that hardware component where you, they, partners can sell, increase the sale of the phone itself. So there's a lot more revenue to be had than people can't buy our phones on Amazon, right? So they, they can't go to Amazon and cost compare you. And it's just a huge value for a partner because there's more cost control. So that's, that's one, so partners. But because we have a, just a high focus for value to the customer, typically in the, this crowded space, people are licensing a, a big soft switch, probably a broad soft or a meta switch, and those are good products, but they're being licensed to death. So if I was up for Vonage, for an example, okay, so they use a broad soft backend, and broad soft comes out with one new software release, maybe two a year, and they're very expensive to acquire. So when Vonage acquired Simple Signal, they were on version 20, and when they acquired Telesphere, Telesphere was back on either version 17 or 18 or something like that. And so that's just millions of dollars for them to upgrade. Additionally, 911 is an extra cost, $5 a month per location. We can include that because it's our software. Auto attendants are an additional $5 a month per auto attendant, which is that, thanks for calling my company, press one for this. Well, customers usually need more than one. But we can include that at no additional charge. Call center is usually brought in through a third party, and so there's licensing, and that's, of course, passed on to the customer in terms of, like, $50 a user up to $200 a user. And we can include that at no charge because we've built that in-house. So we address the customer requirements, and then we provide them lifetime warranty. So they're getting all this at $20 a seat, not $30, not $40, not $50. So we can be very competitively priced. And that's not our big differentiator price, but it certainly helps in a competitive space. And we find that partners, especially new partners, especially SaaS partners, find it an easier conversation to have in the beginning. And then, you know, we allow our SaaS partners to build in monthly management fees and uh, the installation fee. And we want our partners to be successful. We don't want them doing things for free. Customers don't want them doing things for free because then they end up getting 
you know, less than stellar service. So we've been able to really build the program with the customer in mind and partners usually love their customers, right? Just like we love our partners and our customers. So we wanted to provide the highest value for our partners to pass on to their customers. And because we've done that, we've been really successful with the partners that we've had, that we have. Excellent. Great response. Um, so I think that our time is pretty much up. And uh, what I would encourage everyone to do is, you know, if, if you look around at other competing products, you will see how competitive their channel program is. You'll also realize how easily accessible Cassandra and her team are to uh, to you and to answering your questions and supporting you and um, I, I'd encourage you to give it a try we've we've just uh, had such a great experience with Crescendo and uh, our partners that you know we're really happy and proud to be able to continue to uh, offer this along with this the extra special offers and bounties that they provide to you as part of the SASMAX community so um, exactly. everyone have a great day. Cassandra, thank you so much for taking the time again. And uh, for those of you who, uh, uh, who need to get in touch with SASMAX directly or would like us to introduce you directly to Cassandra, uh, our contact information is here. It's, uh, I'm Dina Moskowitz again, and it's Dina at SASMAX.com. I have Clinton Gatewood also, who most of you probably know. He's a VP of Reseller and Channel Engagement, and usually your first point of contact when you've joined SASMAX. And we encourage you to stay in touch with us and let us know the types of SAS solutions you're looking for and what new types of customers you have and how you're bundling so that we can continue to make the right matches for you. So have a great day, and thanks again, and we look forward to uh, seeing you at future SASMAX Snapshot webinars. Also, for those of you who plan to be in Chicago next week at the Retail IT VAR of the Future event, we will be there, and actually Cassandra will be there as well, as will QuickBooks Point of Sale. Uh, so we encourage you to come and, and meet us as well. All right, take care, everyone. Bye-bye.